Hello, today I'm here with a new video and today I'm here with a collab and I love doing collabs and today I am doing my second face off and it is with Prue LaRue or Prue from Prue LaRue and we are doing a face up off with the Monasa palette from Blush Tribe and I will of course leave Prue's channel up here and also down in the description and as well as her video and you have to check out Prue. If you have not done that, you need to do it as fast as you have checked this video out. Because she is so funny and she making great videos and she should have so much more subscribers than she have. So go and check her out and yeah, we will start with this face off. This face off thing is, thing. this face off idea is from Danielle Schmidt. Uh, me and Danielle, we did a face-off as well. I can leave that up here as well. Prue and I are going to do one look with the same colors. So she's doing one look with these five colors and I'm doing one. So the colors we have to play with in this look is Earth, this green one. And also Kimberly, this shimmer one. And Amanda, this shimmer. And Serengeti. And also Simba. I didn't say that. So Simba, Earth, and Kimberly, Amanda, and Serengeti. And I have swatched the colors here, so I have some clue of what I will do. And I think, I know, I am pretty sure. So I think I will start with Serengeti, this brown one, and take it in my whole crease. But I think this, this is pretty dark, so maybe not the whole way in. And I tap it off and... In my crease it's pretty dark yes so maybe I blend it out to my inner corner and has it a little bit darker on the outer crease than the inner crease and this brown I did not want this in this look so I take the easy way out and just put it in my crease and Prue, I have talked a little bit about Prue before. I did a makeup, not a makeup tag. I did a tag that she and Annette created, and that was such a fun tag. And I found Prue through Annette um, a couple of months ago. And yeah, I you should really check her out. And I am a little bit jealous of you, Prue, because you live in Australia. And I really, really, really want to go to Australia sometime. But the flying time from Sweden to Australia, it's like 24 hours, if not more. And we are pretty far apart. Uh, but someday, I really want to go to Australia. I have <laughs> think about this a little bit. I I live in Sweden, as you know, and I think Sweden is a pretty boring country. Um, we don't have any fun animals. We don't have any like the animal life in most countries of Africa, like Kenya, Kenya, Kenya. Um, with like giraffes and rhinos and elephants and stuff like that. We have like a moose, a deer and bears. Bears. Um, and that's all. Yeah, we have other animals as well, but we don't have these cool animals. But I don't think maybe everybody thinks so. I don't think, do you, Prue, think it's cool to live in Australia? Are you like satisfied? Like, yeah, this is the place I want to live in the rest of my life. I don't know. Maybe I think Sweden is boring because I have lived my whole life in Sweden. Okay, so stop talking about that. I'm going to take Earth, this one. I like this palette. I like the size of it. I like it's cardboard, but I don't like the inside. It's I think it's too shiny. Um, I think the background is taking some 
spotlight from the shadows so I I don't like this shiny things but it's a nice palette but I don't like it okay stop talking and do your makeup instead okay I'm gonna do it like this I'm gonna take Amanda instead and put this on my outer half of my eyelid this pigmentation where did you go And this is also my first impression or my first time I'm using the Manasa but I think like it's the same with Uvias when I'm trying a new Uvias place I already know how the formula would be because it feels like brands are pretty consistent with their formula so I love my other blush try palettes and this palette is no exception. And I have had the Manasa palette for a couple of weeks. I got it at the same time I got the Paulina and blush dry palette. But I <laughs> I wanted to use the Paulina palette first because I love that palette. And right now I have so many palettes to try out and there is more palettes coming. So when Prue and I said that we were oh I fall out. we're going to do this face off, I like can we take the Manasa palette? Because I just saw that she received hers and then I thought like yeah, this is a good chance for me to use the Manasa palette. And it's going to be so fun to see what Prue comes up with. I wish like in some of if I do more face offs, I wish that we me and the one I do in the face off will do the same look. That would be really fun. So now I'm taking earth and put it on my inner half of the lid. And I swatched these and the Simba one, this one, it felt a bit dry. Uh, and some of Blush Tribe's shadows feel a little bit dry but they are usually good to work with even if they feel dry but this earth it felt very very soft and I think this shadow is you need to build it up because it's not as opaque as I want it to be nothing wrong with that one thing I really like about blush tribes their shadows are so easy to blend together like the shimmer one and the matte one so easy okay i think i am done with my lids so i will take away the fallouts and then we have two colors left to use so we have simba and kimberly left so i will fix my base and i will come back and we use these two last colors and then we will see the finished look so the face is on and it's time for do the under eyes and I am going to use Simba the whole way and then for Kimberly I have a plan for her too. So we start with Simba. And this shadow was a little bit dry but the swatch is amazing so you don't have to be afraid of a shadow just because it feels dry it doesn't mean it's bad. So Simba is now underneath my eyes and now we have the one shade left and that is Kimberly. And I am going to take Kimberly in my inner corner and I want it to be so much. I want it to be up here as well and also down here. So I will try to do this. I'm not so good at this and now okay, can I do like this. I'm testing a new setup today. If you don't see that so the camera is right in front of me usually it's a little bit higher so it falls me from a little bit above but I don't really like it and now I don't have the mirror will not fit in here so I have one palette with a mirror and then I have the Munasa so okay we will see how this goes 
and I won't sell much of this. I don't know if I look crazy right now, maybe I do. But I love this on others, like this really blown out inner corner with some shimmery thing. Okay, that went good. So now all the colors are on my eyes. So we have used Simba, Earth, Kimberly, Amanda and Serengeti. And I will put on a mascara and something on my lips and then I will be back and you will see the complete look. So this is the finished look and I don't know what I think about the lipstick. This is Stone Fox from Colourpop. It's a super pink light shade and this is not my thing at all but I maybe I want to explore new things now this year. So this was my look that I'm come up with in this face off with the Prue and I think I really like it. It feels a little bit like I'm doing the same thing over and over again on my channel but I hope you like it and uh, I have put a crayon from Linda Holberg in my waterline. It's likeable mood. It's the orange one and I like this look and I think this is so fun to do and I am so glad that Prue wanted to do a face off with me because it's going to be so fun to see what she comes up with with the same colors that I've used. And for the Manasa palette, it's a really good palette. It is like all the other palettes from Blush Tribe. It is a good palette. I'm not thrilled about the inside of the packaging, but I can live with it. So yeah, this was the face off with the Manasa palette with Prue LaRue so don't forget to check out Prue and give her your support because she is so fun to watch and she deserves so much more subscribers than she has so go and check her video out and I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you're not subscribing to me please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I will see you in the next one. Bye!